Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. For those who are new, hello, welcome, I am Nisha. And for those who have already been here, what I do, baby boo, welcome back to the channel. Well, today we are finally, finally, long overdue. I think I promised you guys this two weeks ago and didn't proceed with it. So we're proceeding now. <laughs> I don't know what I'm about to say. We're proceeding now. I told you guys at least once a week I was going to do a lip swatch video. This is going to hopefully help me get through my decluttering or just pretty much just introduce myself into some new lipsticks so that way I'm not repeating and using the same lip shades and lipsticks because I buy so many different variety colors. You think the only thing I have in my collection is new lips. And it's not true. I have pinks, I have purples, I have orange, I have, I have red, like I have colors. So it's just very peculiar of me to stick to the same color combo when it comes to my lips. So so I already started this series. Uh, so if you guys want to play a little catch up or just see my other um, videos that I've done so far, I will link it down at the bottom. There's a playlist of my lip swatch video of my collection. You guys voted that y'all want me to do and stick to the brands. Don't do the color theme, the brands. So I'm gonna be doing a lip swatch of all of this particular lip brand that I have in my collection. I feel like I'm missing one lipstick and I search high and low in this room and it's not like this room is spotless so it, it's, I can't find it. But I know for sure I'm missing one lipstick from this particular brand. As you guys can see from the title, we're doing Morphe today. Yeah, so I have not that many. I thought I would have had a little bit more, but y'all know from my recent hauls that I did purchase some of the newest lip products from Morphe. I purchased, um, I did have two of the lip pencil, but I took one of them back because it was disgusting. It was ugly. It was not for me. So right now I only have one of the lip pencil and then I have a couple of the Soulmate is the name of the new liquid, liquid lipsticks by Morphe. Soul, I'm sorry, Soul Matte. Have I been saying Soul Matte the whole? I think I have been saying that. It's Soul Matte. So I got a couple of shades from the new Soul Matte lipstick collection, and then I also got a couple of shades from the new lip gloss collection from Morphe, the Dip Glass Glaze, and then of course some other new but some good lipsticks from Morphe as well. So let's go ahead and get into this video. I'm going to wipe off what I have. I'm pretty much just going to just do a raw swatch. If I feel like the lip color, whatever needs a little bit of a pencil, being that I only have this burgundy one, I'm probably going to use my favorite brown pencil, which is by NYX. So I will include that for my colors that look a little too pale or too washed down uh, for my complexion. But anywho, let's go ahead and get into this video.
lips is definitely giving num 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 vibes but i think i ended off very well with the glosses i think that was a very smart decision so y'all see i got some colors i got some different things um i do have a few little dislikes on some of the shades are i should say questionable because y'all know me when i do my lip combos i don't just stick to one lip color so i also have to keep that in mind because sometimes i'm like okay wait this looks weird by itself but i'm like you can combine it with other things but i'm like is this just an excuse for me to hold on to so many things so i don't know so as for the first two shades or well, first three shades there are a older um, Morphe lip product. So they're here for me forever because they've been in my collection forever. So they're not going anywhere. But as for like the new lip colors, like the actual Soul Matte colors, two shades in particular, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them. You guys let me know down in the comment section because like I said, I'm my biggest, biggest critique person on myself. Like I'm the hardest on myself. Um, but the brown and that burgundy shade. Other half and compatible. They look very similar. I thought this brown was going to give more of a deeper, like 90s vibe brown, but she didn't give me that. And then as for this purple, I thought she was going to be more of a deeper purple. But one thing I am noticing with the Soul Matte formula is that it's very, very, very sheer. Um, I know it says about mousse. It's the velvet mousse, but honestly, this is not a really good formula when it comes to the payoff for the deeper shade. I feel like it's a good payoff and formula for the two pale colors, like the nude ones. But I think once you get deeper into the deeper shades when it comes to this collection, I feel like a lot of the lipsticks are gonna be very, very sheer. And if you're someone like me who has this coloration when it comes to the lips, um, it's gonna be really hard for you to cover up that natural pink lip at the bottom. Like it's going to show, you're gonna need a lot of coating in it. One thing I did notice that it didn't fully dry down all the way because it's, it reminds me a lot of the Fenty Velvety lipsticks, except these are a lot more less messier than those. But Fenty is a lot more pigmented, if you get what I'm saying. So yeah, I think these two might go back. Now that I'm speaking out loud, I'm like, I'm sure I have something similar like this in my collection with better payoff. I think they try, but like I said, once you get deeper into the shades, I feel like you can really see like those streaks and it was just not giving, it was not giving except for the red one um the red one i definitely feel like i'm going to keep her she was something special especially when i added her with the actual soul matte uh, pencil this was a really cute combo for the drip glass first of all let me say the um formula of these oh my gosh my lips feel so hydrated so moisturized and y'all know me i am a glossy girl i love to add gloss to my matte lips so i'm here for these glosses i don't think any of them is going back except for one maybe and that's because she didn't really show up on my complexion for my lips but she would be a really cute lip topper so you know what i'm gonna find an excuse to keep her anyway so anyway yes but i do like the the lip glass these are really 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 pigmented and really pretty so if you're looking for something that give you a little bit of a tint on the lips but not too much but definitely giving you that 90s vibe gloss these are definitely it oh my gosh my lips feel so freaking hydrated like yes love them love them love them yes okay but anywho this is my morphe collection let me know what lip shade was your favorite and what lip shade should definitely go back to the market <laughs> to the O2 market okay thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys like and enjoy today's video and i will see you guys tomorrow with another one bye